as we roll into the season of giving gifts, let's go ahead and look at one of the most famous gifts ever given and how 3D printing actually makes these new and different from what they were ever done before. So snow globes have been around from 1900. They were actually invented by a guy named Erwin Percy in Austria, and they were invented as a way to magnify light, because if you shine light through here, you can see that it magnifies the light. But they were always very interesting because they were brought back during World War II as souvenirs from Austria by the American soldiers, and that's when they became popularized. And as they started getting made more affordably, they were used by more people. I have always loved snow globes because number one, circles are amazing, but these are also interesting because if you go into a gift shop, you will see so many different types of snow globes. And it's actually quite expensive to create those. Those ceramic inserts that are often used in these are actually quite expensive, which is why a lot of snow globes are 25, 50, 100 bucks, even today. So they are a premium type of gift. But here's the thing, 3D printing improves that because now you're able to create those custom internals in a way that was never really possible before and it becomes very affordable to create high number of variations. Here with this original design, what we did was we just created a simple swirl that actually engages with the flakes inside in a more interesting way to where the snow globe goes from being an interesting kind of object to where you could have a scene inside of there to something that you can engage with and it's kind of like a fidget toy. It's much more interesting than other sorts of options. But you can take this further. This is like the fidget toy version. It's not that interesting, it's white. But if you want something seasonal, you can go ahead and make a snowman and it can go inside of there. And now you've created a new version. You can mess with the colors. And of course you can get different with the swirls. You can create geometries that were never possible before. 3D printing enables this. All you have to do is design that internal and then start to use it. A little bit of creativity can go a long way in a way that was never possible before. Now, with this particular design, so that all of you who would want to make it yourselves can get a hold of it, this is an off-the-shelf snow globe that you can get from a place like Amazon, and it's just standard water on the internals. Oddly enough, and for all of you watching, those flakes themselves are actually 3D printed support material that are left over that we thought would look cool inside of there, and since they're made of PLA, they actually have kind of an almost neutral buoyancy, a little bit of sinking on there, but overall they're great. And it's a fantastic kind of flake material for this kind of thing. So if you have a class or you want to build your own snow globes and start to sell them, this is the way to do it, where your printer waste actually becomes part of the product itself, but you're able to take advantage of the variations created by 3D printing to create really original products. And in the near future, these types of snow globes will be able to be included with 3D printed parts from our apps like the Teleport app, where you can connect our print farm to your Etsy stores so that whenever you sell a snow globe, we could print this part and throw the globe inside of it. That will be coming in the new year very soon, but until then, start creating the designs. There are so many new products that are improved and elevated by 3D printing now that 3D printing is scalable, affordable, and on demand. So the question is really, what would you create when given this much control? Have a Merry Christmas, everybody, and hopefully you enjoy and can create something awesome in the new year. See y'all later.